With doubtnet, get instant video solutions to all your maths, physics, chemistry and biology doubts. Just click the image of the question, crop the question and get instant video solution. Download doubtnet app today. Hello everyone, the distance travelled by a body during last second of its upward motion is d when the body is projected with certain velocity vertically upward if the velocity of the projection is doubled, the distance travelled by the body during last second of its upward journey is. So if you see, let's say you projected some body with a speed u. So it is said that in last second of its upward journey, it travelled a distance of d. So if you see, there will be symmetry about the maximum height. Right? If I say that the body travel d distance in delta t equals to 1 second. So same d distance will be covered in delta t after reaching the maximum height. So it will be a case when the object is dropped and how much it, it traveled in 1 second. You can just get that by writing down. Right, so if you see in one second how much it travel. So if you change the speed, right, if you change the initial speed, nothing will change because if you see the symmetry, it will go like this and it will come like this. Right, so if you see here, it, it takes some one second to travel this D distance to go from here to here. And uh, the same time it will take to travel the same d distance that is one second it will be it will be taking to come from here to here and it will be covering d distance again right so it will be d thank you for class 6 to 12 itj and neat level trusted by more than 5 crore students download doubt and app today